Hello students. Today we will do multiplication without regrouping and with regrouping. Students, let us start with multiplication of a three digit number by a one digit number. Multiplication without regrouping. So you have to multiply here without carrying over. Okay? So, let us start with question number 24. Multiply the following numbers as shown. So, number A is done. So, you can see here, you have to multiply 313 by 2. So, 2 3s are 6, 2 1s are 2 and 2 3s are 6. Question number B, you have to multiply 432 by 2. So, let us multiply 2 2 is 4. Then 2 3 is 6. 2 4 is 8. The answer is 864. Question number C, we have to multiply 211 by 4. So, let us multiply 4 ones are 4. 4 ones are 4. 4 twos are 8. So, answer is 800. 44. Okay. Now question number D. We have to multiply 223 by 3. So now 3 3 is 9. 3 2 is 6. 3 2 is 6. And the answer is 669. Question number E. 221 by 4. So now let us multiply. 4 ones are 4. 4 twos are 8. 4 twos are 8. And the answer is. 884. Let us move to the next number F. 122 by 2. So now 2 2 is 4. 2 2 is 4. 2 1 is 2. So, 244 is the answer. Okay? It is easy, isn't it? So, alright. So, you have to do question number G, H and I for your homework. Okay, students? Next, we have multiplication with regrouping. Now, here you have to multiply by carrying over. Okay? So, question number 25, multiply by regrouping as shown. So, question number A is shown here, 113 by 4. So, now let us multiply 4, 3 is 12. So, we write here 2 and then 1 is carried over. After that, 4, 1 is 4 plus 1, it is 5. And next is 4, 1s are 4, we write here 4. And the answer is 452. So now same way, we will do question number B. 264 by 2. So we have to multiply 264 by 2. So, now 2 4s are 8, 
2 6 za 12 you write here 2 and then 1 will be carried over here okay and then 2 2 za 4 plus 1 it is 5 and the answer is 528 Question number C. 9, 9 into 6. Then you have to multiply 9 into 0 and then 9 into 1. 9, 6 is 54. So I will write here 4 and then 5 will be carried over. 9 zeros are 0. So, anything multiplied by 0 is always 0. So, 9 into 0 is 0. But 0 plus 5 will be 5. Okay. 0 plus 5 is 5. And here, 9 ones are 9. And the answer is 900. 54. So, students, I hope you have understood. Okay. So, now let us move to the next number D. 217 by 3. 3 sevens are 21. 1 is written here and 2 is carried over. 3 ones are 3 plus 2. Plus 2, we have to write 3 plus 2 is 5. So, we will write here 5. Next, 3 2 is 6. And the answer is 651. Okay. Now, question number E. 251 into 3. So, 3 1 is 3. 3 5s are 15. 5 is written here and 1 is carried over. So now 3 2s are 6. 6 plus 1 is 7. And the final answer is 753. Number F 114 into 7. 7 4s are 28. So, I will write here 8 and then 2 is carried over. 7 ones are 7. 7 plus 2 it is 9. 7 ones are 7. So, answer we are getting 798. Okay. So, same way you will have to do question number G, H and I. Okay, students. Next is question number 26. Multiply by regrouping as shown. So, this also you have to multiply by regrouping. That means by carrying over. Okay. Now, look at question number A. 235 by 3. So, 3 fives are 15 and 1 is carried over. 3 threes are 9. 9 plus 1 is 10. So, you will have to write here 0 and 1 is carried over. Then 3 2 is 6. 6 plus 1 is 7. And the answer is 705. Okay. Now, number B, 122 into 6. 6 2 is 12. 2 and then 1 is carried over. 6 2s are 12. 12 plus 1 is 13. So, we will write here 3 and then 1 is carried over. 6 1s are 6 and 6 plus 1 is 7. So, now students, if you look at this number 26, so what is the difference you find 
previously in question number 25 you have done multiplication by regrouping that means you have carried over only once but out here you have to carry two times okay so now question number c 153 into 4 4 threes are 12 2 and 1 is carried over 4 fives are 20 20 plus 1 it is 21 1 and then 2 is carried over 4 ones are 4 4 plus 2 is 6 answer is 612 Question number D, 163 into 6. So, 6 into 3. 6 threes are 18. 8 and 1 is carried over. 6, 6 are 36. 36 plus 1 is 37. So, 7 will be written here. And 3 is carried over. 6 ones are 6. 6 plus 3 is 9. And the answer is 978. Okay. So, you will have to do number E and F by yourself. Okay, students. Students, I will stop here today and will continue in the next class. Alright, thank you.